Uh, I guess I should record and rolling. Okay. All righty. I'm a little big boy. I'm a big little boy. Testing, testing my big little boy mic. Hello. Hi. Hello, sticky, crusty grandpas. Oh, so good to see you. So, so very good. Let's post and let's uh, 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 tweet. And uh, we're fucking live. Why do I look so blurry? Fucking sucks. Whatever. Um, all right, we're live. We're gonna we're gonna have some fun tonight. Maybe I don't know. Um, a chroma key? No, I don't think it's a chroma key. I think I just suck. Um, anywho, who cares? How are you guys doing? Welcome, welcome to the actual stream. I did a little earlier bazinga today with the uh, Nintendo um, Direct thing because I. I thought we get the final Smash reveal, and we didn't. But what we got was so much worse. <laughs> Chris Pratt's Mario, ladies and gentlemen. Chris Pratt is fucking motherfucking Mario. Let's go. Why are you booing? Whoa, whoa. Why are we all? <laughs> uh oh, stinky. Um, Chris Pratt impression. I can do a pretty good pr Chris Pratt impression. Yeah. All right. Imagine he's wearing his own Mario hat, his guy's own Mario mustache. This is what Chris Pratt will be like in the upcoming Mario movie made by uh, Illumination. <laughs> wow, Mamma Mia. Uh, it's me, uh, Mario Mario. And I love lasagna. Yahoo and Wahoo. <laughs> uh, so long, gay Bowser. Uh, so that's, that's what Mario says. Uh, and I'm very excited for Chris Pratt to put his very fun, epic Star Lord spin on uh, Mario Mario. Really excited, you know. Uh, so fucking ready uh, for Chris Pratt to be in all the things. All right, enough about the Prattster. He's a real prankster, that Prattster. Um, I need a drink. Oh, I have one. Here we go. Hey, Chip, come here. Hey, Chip, which don't run away from me, you coward. Come here. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Fucking pussy. All right, look, um, I need to do my, let's do a cringy um, intro for YouTube, okay? Let's do a, oh, there's something in my drink. It's not a bug, it's like a pillow feather. All right, anywho. All right, this is uh, Limoncello and uh, LaCroix. Here we go. Hi. <laughs> That's a good start. That'll off put everyone. Um, stop smiling. It's time to do <laughs> Hold on. Stop smiling. It's time to be sad. Yesterday, I asked you to make me cry in just four words. Here are your sad answers that I'm crying for the first time. And then let's do the let's do the TikTok slash YouTube Shorts intro. Here we go. If I cry, the video will end. Um, and then uh, uh, I asked you to write the saddest story you could think of in just four words. I asked you to write. I asked you to write your saddest stories in just four words. Here we go, Mamma Mia. <laughs> I, won't, <laughs> I won't do that. Okay, I hit record. Don't worry, I hit record this time. Thank you for reminding me. Um. <laughs> All righty. Yeah, I'll, I'll add Mamma Mia. All right, so are you guys ready for some uh, motherfucking uh, sadness? I'm ready. Let's fucking go. Okay, let's go. I'm ready. Uh, should I do the prayer? Queen Amanda really wants me to do the prayer. <laughs> I'm sorry. I literally just saw this person's username. Pissing and fisting. That's incredible. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's so good. Uh... uh... Shitting and farting and pissing and fisting. Okay. 
What? <laughs> Everyone shut up. It's prayer time. Shut up. Welcome, welcome, one and all. Welcome, welcome, fat and small. Welcome, welcome. Oh, I fucked up the prayer. <laughs> Chipwitch, stop. I'm trying to pray. Everyone bow your fucking heads. Bow your heads. Come on. Be respectful. It's a prayer. Welcome, welcome, one and all. Welcome, welcome, big and small. Welcome, welcome, fat and thin. Welcome, welcome. Let's begin. All right, raise your raise your fucking heads up. All right. Okay. Here we go. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? Um, here we go. Hey, Chip. Chip, do you have to do that right now? Do you have to do that right now, Chip? All right. No pissing and fisting, okay? <laughs> Chipwitch, what, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? There's nothing there for you. Oh my god, you have the worst timing. She has the worst timing. She's scratching at the fucking door. Chip, Chip. I'm a professional Twitch streamer, and I'm trying to make professional dollars. What's so important that you have to claw at the fucking door? What's, what is it? What is it? What's on the other side of this door? Oh, is it not? Oh, it's a, oh, there is a bone. Okay, there is a bone. It was this bone. It was, it was this, it almost fell and died. Okay. That's actually kind of funny. Everyone laughed. That was really funny. <laughs> okay. This is Chip. Oh, 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 show those, show him those chompers. Oh, okay. Good girl. Run away. Run away. Good girl. She's, she's as happy as a dog with a bone. <laughs> and she gone? Okay. No more chip witch. No one gives a shit about chip witch, I asked. Okay. Let's take another swig of our gamer juice. And if anyone's asking, it's lemon shell. It's a shot and a half of lemon shell liqueur and lemon shell flavored LaCroix. They pair very nicely together if you're feeling fancy. All right, let's go. Here you go. Here are your answers that, so you're gonna try to make me cry. Um, I asked you guys for your saddest stories or write the saddest thing you can think of, but you only had four words to do it. I only gave you four words to write the saddest sentence you could think of. The goal is to make me cry. Um, that's what the lemon cello is for. It elicits real tears. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, this is from this is from pissing and fisting. <clears throat> Sale, lame shoeless baby. Oh, that's so sad. That's so sad. Oh, that poor lame shoeless baby. Who will buy a lame shoeless baby? Hey, Chip, can you? She's so stupid. She's playing by the fucking door. Can you even see this? Like, oh. <laughs> She's literally like pushing it under the door and then she whines when it's under the door past her reach. And it's like, hey baby, don't fucking play right by the, 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 the door. You idiot. All right. That was really funny. All right. She wants attention? Well, get in line. Don't we all? Okay. I think the username was better than the answer. So can we get a shout out to pissing and fisting? Here we go. Next up. It was not chocolate. <laughs> Look, <laughs> I'm not the biggest toilet humor fan, but when it catches me off guard, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Okay. Good job, uh, Desperado. What else we got? Dustpan for Spider-Man. Oh, get it? Because he died? Oh, I get it. I just got it. But, bro, you're like two years late. No. Three years too late. Spider-Boy got disintegrated in 2018. We're still making fucking Infinity War jokes? You, you make me sad. Maybe that was the point. 
fucking awful. Next up. An aspiring cadaver. It's a good one. Instead, he watches hentai. What's that about that? That's cool as hell. <laughs> uh, let's keep going. Jeff. I look like this. We can do better. We can do better than a Puss in Boots reference. I think that's what that is. It is sad. It is very sad indeed, Kaiden. I'm sorry for your uh, medical condition. You may want to get that looked at. Hi, if you're just tuning in, <clears throat> if you're just tuning in, we're having a lovely display of, um, right, the saddest thing you can think of in four words. Our lovely council has picked out um, a plethora of your submissions, and um, I have yet to cry. I, I have yet to weep big, fat, sopping tears. Um, and, uh, it, you know, it's even sadder than all of your answers so far. I'm not drunk yet. I'm still very sober. Hopefully, uh, oh, Beth says the tears are coming. Thank you, Beth. Okay, good. Let's keep going. Why did I snub Puss in Boots in your Shrek tier list? I've never seen Puss in Boots. I never gave it the chance. Is that any good? Does any, no one ever talks about Puss in Boots. Like, this... This answer, like, this is the only Puss in Boots reference I think I've seen in about 10 years. No one talks about it. People talk more about Shrek 4 than Puss in Boots. You know what I'm saying, gamers? All right, let's keep going. These aren't sad yet. I am Iron Man. Uh-huh. What am I missing here? <laughs> like, what... Because he dies? I, yeah. But it's funny, though. <laughs> oh, I got endgamed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, remember when he was like Andre 3000 or whatever? That was very sad. All right, let's keep going. Someone wrote, lol, get it? <laughs> I like that. Alrighty, let's keep going. Um, very sad answers. Okay, I don't want to cheat. There we go. This is from Cube of Swag, Swag Cube. James Corden mouse costume. That was very sad for everyone involved. Um, the poor people stuck in their cars, just trying to get to their jobs. Um, all of the cast members of that Cinderella movie no one's watching. Uh... Did anyone see that fucking... I did not see the new Cinder... I, I'm all cinderella out. I'm all cinderella out. Disney already did the live-action one. I grew up on the on the, on the the Brandy Cinderella. So it's like, I'm I'm all cinderella out. I don't need another fucking live-action Cinderella. Especially one with James Corden. Don't need it. I'm just... I don't need... Yeah, exactly. Someone wrote, there's a new Cinderella. Yeah, exactly. That's what that fucking stunt was for. In case you didn't realize, like... Why was James Corden in a rat costume dancing in the streets? It was for that movie that you didn't see. <laughs> Worth it. Yeah, you can't buy that kind of press. Um, okay. Let's keep going. Hey, Chip. No, thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, hold on. We we need to take a break, gamers. Drink up. Finish your drinks. I'm not sad yet. Come here, Chip. Yeah. Woo, 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 woo. All right. Hey, honey.
Uh, uh, okay. Alrighty. Let's keep going. So yeah, they made like 18 Cinderella's. Let's, um... <sighs> a cheers, by the way. Alright. Sorry, Erin just came back from the hair salon. She looks, she looks great. Um, so I just had to greet her. Um, God, Chip just like, Chip really scratches you up, man. It's, what the fuck is that about? All right. We need to put her down. All right. Make me sad in four words. Let's go. We're going to cry. Myro Maker, Joy-Con Drift. A very specific problem to be sure, but one I can relate to. It, uh, it ruined my Mario Maker, uh, um, uh, playtime <laughs> for about a week. Uh, somehow the Joy-Con drift corrected itself, but yeah, it was very sad. Almost as sad as this answer. <laughs> Let's keep going. Let's chew our ice, hold on. Alright. Tweet didn't do numbers. It is... Oh, and it didn't do numbers. It only got one like. This is the saddest thing I've ever seen. Shit. I'm sorry, Cameron. I'm sorry, Bloxbox. Oh, my God. We got to pour one out. We got to pour one out for Cameron Bloxbox. And by pour one out, I mean in my mouth. Mm. Oh. Really, really sad. Uh, 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 let's keep going. That's the last nug. Ah, oh, that's super depressing. When you're down to the last nug and mom won't make any more because she's all out of tendies and nugs, even though you've like saved up all your good boy points, that's the worst. That's This is tragic. Oh, I like this if you cry every time. Oh, remember that copy pasta? Holy shit. That's like 10 years old. Like this if you cry every time. Oh, that was the best. I we need more of those. Okay. More answers. Mr. Unga Bunga, Luigi's only two inches. Hmm. That's that sucks. Poor guy. We shouldn't. This is this is a disgustingly ableist um, submission. Okay. Council, I'm ashamed. For some people, two inches is more than enough. All right. How dare you? <laughs> there are thousands of us. <laughs> <coughs> oh, this is super sad. Uh, mm mm mm. Speaking from experience, no, not at all. I just, I know, I know a guy, I know a friend. I have a friend who suffers this and you know what? He lives a really um, uh, active sex life. So, you know, how, how dare you all? Let's keep going. Poor Luigi. The mods got fired. That's not sad. That would be joyous. Mods, I'm not crying yet. I, 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 luckily, the night is young. We still have many, many. We're not even at the halfway. We're like at the third um, point. So that's good. We're not even at the halfway point yet. Um, my tear ducts are dry. My face is dry. My eyes are dry. Everything's dry. I, sh I may fire you after this mods. I might just, I might just, I may, I might just, I might just, I might, I might just fire you. It might just happen. All right. Let's, we, we got to step it up. This is supposed to be a tragic day. Come on. Chris Pratt is the voice of Mario for the movie. That, first off, Mario doesn't need a fucking movie. Second, Chris, Chris Pratt? 
Really? Him? Charlie Day is Luigi, I get. That's just stellar casting. Chris Pratt, though? Like, I don't know. Yikes. Yikes is all I have to say. All right. Let's keep going. Mommy said... <laughs> why, why is milk in quotes? Why is milk in quotes? <laughs> This one's extremely sad. Uh, I, uh, yeah. Let's push the sad piano button on my soundboard. This is very sad. Oh my God. Terrible. <laughs> Ooh, someone wrote, why is milk in quotes and mommy isn't? <laughs> mommy said no milk. Oh, that's. Oh, that's somehow worse. That is somehow worse. Uh, thank you very much, sexy orphan. <laughs> Great submission. Um, now the waterworks are slowly, uh, are they're slowly coming. It's slowly, very slowly happening. Okay. More answers from Owen. Dad said no sex. Let's raise the stakes. If I, all right. These are, now we're getting into, um, you know, very sad answers. If, <laughs> if an answer is super sad, I think I should give some subs. What do you guys think? If an answer is very, very sad, I think I should. Holy shit. Speaking of gifting subs, almost as if on cue, James the Sheriff Dixon just gifted 10 tier one subs to the community. What up, hero? Well, then. I need to I need to add to that. If I break, if I if I laugh or cry during any of these, I think I should gift uh, some subs. But I don't think it's gonna happen. I don't. Excuse me. I don't think uh, I don't think it'll happen. So let's keep going. If you're just and if you're just tuning in, I'm doing this thing where um, I asked you guys a few days ago to write the saddest story you can think of. The saddest story. Excuse me, but you can only use four words. So I'm calling this the "Make Me Cry in Four Words" episode. You know, um, and uh, we're almost halfway through your submissions. I have yet to cry. I really want some uh, fat, wet tears. So if I, yeah, yeah, Julie, Julie, simplified it. Um, if I laugh or cry or shit or fart, <laughs> that doesn't count. Um. If I laugh or cry or shit or fart or 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 piss or fist, um, I have to give. Uh, I will give some subs. All right. Let me make sure this does this even work. Let me make sure this works. Let me just punch in those three numbers in my credit card. And, uh, all right, let's see if it worked. Okay. All right. Here we go. So it works. All right, just gives you some subs. Fuck you, Julie. You're not funny. Um, and, uh, let's keep going. <laughs> Sorry, someone in the chat just wrote, fart with extra reverb. <laughs> That doesn't count. Okay. And here we go. Next one. <laughs> Yo, James, what are you doing? Whoa. Um, James, I think just gifted even more subs. Unless I uh, am mistaken. What a fucking epic uh, uh, beast. Thank you, James. Oh, hell yeah. All right, let's go. It's from fear itself. You write, baby tail. <laughs> no feet. <laughs> okay. All right. 
Now we're getting interesting. All right. Here's uh, here some more subs, I guess. Jesus. Okay. All right. You got me with the baby sale, no feet. Okay. That was decent. But that's it. I'm not going to laugh anymore. I'm not going to cry anymore. Okay? I'm not. I'm not. It's not going to happen. I say we keep going. All right, good job, Fear Itself. It's so sad, though. Imagine a little baby with no feet and it's for sale with a little price tag sticking out. Uh, you know, it's, uh, it's terrible. But, you know, it happens every day. Feet sale, no baby. <laughs> it doesn't count. All right, here we go. <clears throat> oh, that was a good comment, whoever wrote that. Jack, you're not allowed to leave until we're all subbed. It might happen if I... All right, let's keep going. Here we go. Here we go. Next one. Next one. This is from uh, Robot Richie. You write, warmed up ice pack. Super sad. Hate when that happens. Makes me cringe and shit and piss and fart and fard um, and uh, piss and fist. Nostalgia Gamer wrote, baby feet, no sale. <laughs> oh my god. And James the Sheriff Dixon just gifted five more subs to the community. Wicked what a fucking <laughs> show. Uh, Alright. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, I, look, I don't know why, I have, it's not that I have a weakness for the, the baby sale jokes, it's just when you mix up the words, that's fucking funny, because it doesn't make any sense. Baby sale, no feet, that's genius, that's fucking, that's really, alright, we're gonna keep going. Uh, make me cry, here we go. Mom, what is MySpace? Tragic, there is a whole generation out there that will never, ever, ever, ever know what MySpace is, and I'm, I think, you know, 90% of... My viewers tonight, um, are them. <laughs> now you're all just, I, I'm reading the, I'm reading the live chat right now. And you're all just fucking up the, the, the order of the words. People are just writing baby feet, feet, feet. <laughs> oh, I hate you all. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Let's, uh, we're gonna keep going. Oh my god, the chat is, uh, having a fucking field day. That's grand. Here we go. Drinking alone? Been there. Yep. That is sad. That is very sad. It's it's true. I'm drinking alone and nothing is sadder than that. Uh super duper sad. <laughs> Alrighty, we're gonna keep going, guys. Oops, all baby shoes. <laughs> Uh-huh. Okay. 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 There you go. Here's some fu here's some more subs for you fucks. This is That wasn't even good and it still got me. God damn it. I hate it here. I hate it here. Mm. Okay. Can you imagine though, you just pour your cereal and just start spilling out baby shoes? That'd be really cool. All right, let's keep going. My PP broke, been there, never worn. Sorry, can't be, yeah, no wonder Cam hates life. I would too. What else we got? Please let me in. Aw. So this is a video of, uh, this is a still from a video I uploaded um, recently 
but it's a re-upload of a video I uploaded on my second channel a few years ago of my stupid, my stupid dog, my stupid dog Klondike. She's like, she's pressed against the window. She's pressed against the door. She's outside. She's looking in, looking at me inside, and she's just, she's like begging me to let her inside. Meanwhile, right around the corner, we have another set of doors. They're wide fucking open, wide open. And she can't see him, and it's hilarious. She's dumb. Uh, she's gonna die a dummy, you know. So, meanwhile, Sunday's facing the other way. Sunday's even dumber. Let's finish our drink. Mm, okay. We are a little past the halfway point, but we still have a bunch of answers left. There's a lot. There are a lot of chances left uh, to make me cry. So let's keep going. And by the way, for the mods, any of the mods who are still here, I think we should do more try to break me in four words ones. Um, almost like, I think we should do that monthly, if not more. Um, I think it's a fun little challenge. And uh, I, I uh, the first one was such a good success um, that I think we should uh, make that more uh, more frequent. I would, uh, I would love that. Every time I break, I, uh, you know, I donate my dogs. Okay. Perhaps bi-weekly. We will see. We will see. All right, let's go. Public poop. Really loud. The really loud got me. That was, uh, that, and that's super sad. Nothing sad. <laughs> this is fucking fart with reverb. Just restructured. That's all this is. That's all this joke is. It's just a version. This is a version of, uh, uh, well, rules are rules. Oh, my God. We're, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is going to be a very expensive stream for me. But, you know, I'm a man of my word. Okay. Good job, Big Larry. Do you regret this CI or is it good? I think this is good. I think this I think we're having a bit more luck with this than the than the cringe one. Make me cringe one. I think I can crank out not just a YouTube short slash TikTok, but also mayhaps a full video. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. Let's keep going. I did remember to record the stream. Thank you for asking. I did. All right, next up. Make sure the line is matched up before I read anything. All right, this is from Inkling Feet. No dick, no balls. No problem. Come on in. And the... Why, why isn't my wife shutting up the dogs? Oh my gosh, you heard that. <laughs> Are you watching? Oh, gotcha. Sorry, love. <laughs> what? I hear nothing. <laughs> yeah, I heard, I heard dummy. Thank you. Baby, they're trying to make me cry in four words. She said dummy four times. That was pretty sad. That made me feel very sad. That's four. Yeah, that is that counts. Shit. All right, you guys. Let's keep going. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Save it for the podcast. <laughs> she screamed, I want a divorce. Uh, hold on. Excuse me, okay. Let's go. Okay, did I? Yeah, no dick, no balls. All right, make the line match up. All right, this is from, this is from uh, Smooth22Sonic. Oh, I think we have two answers. Okay, we have two answers, here we go. Same answer, more likes. Same answer, more likes. Oh, that's funny. Oh, shit. Smooth got ratioed by Richie. As well they should. That's genius. That what a great play. 
What a lot I'd love to see that happen. I love when this happens. This is my king. That is an actual guys, it's so rare. This is an actual ratio uh that happened. What a beautiful what a beautiful event. We got to see the 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 death of an animal uh live. This is a this is a death. This is a body. My gosh. An anonymous crash just uh, gifted four subs. Thank you, Anonymous Crash. Very kindly for um, making me feel a little better about gifting all these subs. That's still in play, by the way. If I if I if I if I laugh or cry or piss or shit or fart, um, I will um, I will give five subs to the community. But it won't happen. It probably won't happen again. Let's be real. Okay. What up, amazing Tony? Thanks for watching. Yeah, I stream every once in a while. I don't have like a regular streaming schedule yet. Hoping that'll change um, soon. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm doing a live thing right now. It's uh, make me cry in four words. Uh, I mean, don't do it now in the chat. But I mean, well, you can if you'd like. But these are I'm reading answers that my creative council um, has picked out for me in advance, and I'm reading all of these blindly. The challenge was to write the saddest thing you could think of in four words, and these are just really tear-inducing, super duper sad. Okay, super duper sad. Here we go. This is the PP man. I shit your pants. Now, how does that work? How does that happen? <laughs> it doesn't count. I laughed at the avatar. I laughed at this. I laughed. <laughs> I laughed at this. That doesn't, but that, I don't think that, I don't think that counts as a laugh, though. Because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't laugh at, I shit your pants. I don't think so. Yeah, absolutely not. Absolutely not. No. Doesn't count, keep going. Thank you, that's all I need. We're gonna keep going. Uh, Sturbs. Shrek 5 indefinitely delayed. Why would I? I mean, I, all I'm going to do is cry at this. All I'm going to do is cry at this. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, my little voice crack. It's what happens when you're in uh, super puberty. Let's keep going. There we go. Dad didn't kiss back. Oh, goody. More incest. Just what the show needs. More incest. That is sad though. Look at all those sad faces in the in the chat. That should always kiss back. Right, gamers? Come on. Oh, I feel dirty for reading that. <laughs> okay, alright. That's uh that's pretty fucking good. All right. Well, guess what? There's your here are your subs. I'm a man of my word. God damn it! This is targeted. For those who don't know, Don is the first name of my mother. Uh, that's what uh, that's what makes this one uh, extra spicy, super sad, and um, why I need therapy. That's really good. Also, did I see actually in the chat? Is actually actually here? If so, what up, gamer? Hi, yo, what the fuck? It's actually. Wicked. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, right. it's a it's a goofy stream. It's a goofy uh, make me uh, make me cry in four words stream. I asked um, people this question a few days ago. Then I had my little uh, selection council um, pick the best answers, and I'm reading them live for the first time right now. And uh, yeah, good to see you. Um, let's keep going. Soup. Wife touched it. It's true. I, I really, I can't, like, I will not, I will share many things with my wife. I will not share soup. It's disgusting. It's just, no, no, it's a liquid. And it's like, you're eating from a, sp there's so, it, no, it's not hygienic. It, it's, it's the grossest thing. I will never, I will do many things with you, honey. I will never share soup with you. It's just, it's not, no, 
Oh my god, Athena P literally? Yo, what up, Athena P? Yo, you're a rock star. Um, grow up and share that soup. No, fuck you though. <laughs> Athena P, I will ban you from this from this Twitch. If you ever talk to me like that again, I will I will you can pry this the soup ladle from my cold dead hands. I, I, I will never be a, a, a soup sharing boy. All right. Absolutely not. Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> Fucking love Athena P. Aaron, how much do you love Athena P? I love, she was like, I love Athena P. Like we're fucking fans, dude. Like hardcore. Uh, please don't forget us when you like surpass us in everything, okay? Please don't forget us little people, Athena P. You're the funniest fucking person on the planet. That's all. Say that again. Oh yeah, which Athena P, which show are you going to of mine? Of the of the tour? We wanna know. New York Big Boy Club, she writes. We will be there. Aaron will be there, she says. Aaron says, quote, I'm only going for her and I mean that, end quote. So. I don't... Quote, I don't get on cross-country flights for just anybody, end quote. Athena P says, yeah, in all caps, yes, let's grab some drinks. I love being the messenger. <laughs> all right, guys, guys, we need to cry more. We need to cry more. All right, I want real sad answers. Here, here we go. Um, POV, no one loves you. Sorry, sis. Wrong hole. Didn't laugh. That was not a laugh. Who? When did I fucking laugh? I didn't laugh. Mm -mm. I will not. I no. I didn't snort. I had phlegm in my throat. There's a difference. Oh my god. Uh, I'm very excited for the incest only episode of uh, of Yai. What's your best incest joke? And it's and it's 3 hours long. I'm really excited for that. One. <laughs> Someone wrote sorry sis wholesale. <laughs> Oh, fucking, oh my god. Let's keep going. Mm-mm, it didn't count. Uh, Phoebe Vines, great answer, misspelled yai. Trag, I see this every day, multiple times a day, every single day. So, so sad. No one knows how to spell yai, despite it being in existence for six and a half years, and then some. My goodness, it's older than most of you. My goodness. Let's keep going. Ex-wife got my yai tokens. Uh-oh, that's from Jeff Butthole. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> What's twenty more dollars? <laughs> uh, the answer sucked, but the name 
Avatar and Second Name were also good. Oh my god. All so very good. Fucking A. Uh, okay. Baby sale divorced wife. <laughs> okay, cool. Um all right, let me gift like three thousand more subs. All right, here we go. Oh Jesus. Okay. Yai answer never picked. That's close, and that's from Hot Thiggity Thighs. Hot Thiggity. Great name. Good answer. <sighs> so sad. I'm crying so hard, you guys. Oh my god. All right, let's keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> What's a yogurt? <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh fuck. Oh my god. Well, that came from nowhere. Shit. All right, there you go. There's fucking $200 worth of subs tonight. Oh, hell yeah. There you guys go. Merry, Merry Crimbus. Oh my God. I, everything, everything is so good. The, the thumbnail, the title, the caption. Oh God. And it's appropriate. It was sent by Jax Films Breaking. But you know what? Perfect. Alpha male, never yogurt. Oh. Yogurt male men. Or yogurt male are men unafraid of yogurt like true testosterone tubs. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I've never I've never heard this term before. And every like even the 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 the, the X. The little the, the X uh and the word alpha fucking like triggered me into laughing because it's just ah oh. because i see shit like that every day youtube is such a piss hole and a shit and fart hole oh my god uh well we th thankfully for my wallet we are out of answers those are all the answers um and uh, we had some good ones here today i might have enough certainly enough to make a short out of it um, maybe enough to make a, uh, a video. Oh my God. And Elise.com gifted 10 subs to the Wait, community. Yeah. Thanks, gamer. <laughs> best answer. I think the best answer was the yogurt one that caught me off guard. Fucking hardcore. I really, I was not, um, I, I, I really liked, uh, being caught off guard by, um, something that wasn't incest or poop related. Although yogurt is close. So this was a lot of fun. Um, I here's I, I also want to make a guy called um, uh, Make Me Hate You in four words. But I, I think I may, just, I don't know, before I do that, I may just in the future do another break me in four or try to break me in four. Those are a lot of fun. I say those as if I've done it more than once. I just did it the one time and it was a huge success. I might do that. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just, you know what? Let's just, uh, oh, seduce me in four. That's a good one, too. I like that. Seduce me in four words. Ah, oh, shit. Can I write that down? I really like that. I'm going to write down, uh, seduce me in four words. That's a very good answer. I think I like that more than, uh, I, 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 oh my God, and Elise.com, you gifted even more? Jesus, thank you so much. Um, but yeah, let's do Seduce Me in 4, and then we'll, eh, we'll get back to more, uh, Break Me in 4. 
maybe we'll mix it up do break mean four first and then yeah anywho um well that was fun thank you for joining me on this terrible adventure let me stop recording since we're done here what do you guys uh what do you guys feel like talking about i'm not ready to end the night i'm, I'm having too much fun here um how are you guys doing oh you guys watched love on the spectrum that's a good ass show we need to watch more of that have you ever seen ted lasso hell yeah in fact i just talked about ted lasso in the yaya film today i filmed um yaya october or in other words i filmed uh spook me up for halloween 2021 it's the eighth one we've done um we've done it eight years in a row this is our eighth year of doing spook me up for halloween and i just filmed it uh, i'm gonna send that over to um one of our lovely editors kayoya very very talented i think he could uh uh do some very good work with uh with that one it's our eighth one eighth one we've been doing it since 2014 ridiculous um let's see let's see let's see Jack film never worn. We out here olden. I know, right? Honorable mentions. Oh yeah, we have a big fat honorable mentions list this year. Just like just like the past years. Yeah, I read all the honorable mentions. Um, yeah. Oh, someone said that's not eight. Do the math. Watch it. It blew my mind too. But watch it. I know you're like, wait, 2014? That wasn't eight years ago. Yeah, but count it. 2014, 15, 16, 2017, 2018. 2019, 2020, 2021. That's eight, bitch. Yeah, that's eight. So we've been doing it since 2014, and this year will be the eighth year um, that we've been doing. Uh, I know. It, I don't really. Yeah, blew my mind too. Like, wait a minute, how's that work? But it does. Um. Is that good math works? Yeah, that's good math works. Did you see the Mario movie? No, no, but I am going to ask tomorrow. Um, uh, I'm going to ask on uh, Twitter and YouTube community. Um, can we write the Mario movie script? I, I try to say screenplay and script at the same time. Let me try that again. Can we write the Mario movie script one sentence at a time? I, uh, someone suggested that on, uh, on my mentions today, and I thought, oh, that could be very fun. So we're going to uh, do that. Screamed play. That's right. Do another Yai Among Us. We need more. Maybe. I don't know. I haven't played Among Us in a long time. What is something that's making you happy right now? Um, what ARG? What are you talking about? What is that? Yeah, there's some stuff. Sorry, I... I... There's some... There's stuff in the works. I can't... I refuse to talk about it until... Uh, 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 later. But, um, yeah. There's some stuff. Good stuff. Why is Hamilton 3 boxed in red on your YouTube banner? I don't, I don't know. I don't, who knows? Who knows? You can go down some weird rabbit holes on YouTube, you know? Let's see. Um, fin oh, finish RE4 with us, maybe? Shit. I never did, did I? I never finished uh, Resident Evil 4 with you guys. That could be fun. I never got... I feel like I could get used to the PC controls. It was nice seeing everything in HD for the first time, as opposed to my Wii. 
Oh my god, an Elise.com gifted five subs to the community. Elise, thank you so much. What a, what a champ. Why do you call it ARG when A aren't letter G or letter A? That's a really good question. Ooh, Ray just got a PS5. Very cool, Ray. Enjoy your PS5. That sounds, that sounds fun. Do more gaming. I, yeah, I would love to do more gaming. Um, someone brought up Resident Evil 4. That could be a lot of fun. Um, and things like that. Yeah. How is the downward spiral? It's good, you know, good days, bad days, that sort of thing. We really want another Mario Maker stream. Okay. I need to like figure out how to plug in the stream or plug in the, the switch to my PC. <clears throat> you should play the inevitable Mar oh my god, I didn't even think about that. Flamasaurus wrote, you should play the inevitable Mario movie tie-in game. Oh my god. That's, that has to be a train wreck. How is that going to work? That's going to be terrible. But it has to happen, right? Did they ever make an emoji movie game? I, I actually don't know. Emoji movie video game. Did they ever make that? I mean, like a shitty cell game or yeah i don't think that i don't think they okay this, they never made like a ps4 emoji movie video game okay so i'm literally the only one that like asked <clears throat> excuse me but i'm just curious do you play any mobile games on your phone No, I think I, did I download San Andreas and then never play it? I did, I'm such a stupid bitch. All right, I'm gonna try, sorry, I, oh yeah, and it crashes, that's right. I really want, yeah, oh, that sucks. For some reason, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas on Android phones, like, it won't load anymore. And I loved that game, and you can't, you can't play it anymore. That's literally the only game i <clears throat> i have on my uh, on my fold i'm waiting till marriage to get more games when is the flip review oh yeah well i didn't i didn't get the flip i got the fold check your privilege giant difference fuck the flip the flip Flip makes me mad. It's mere existence makes me so mad. I don't understand why they they made the flip. It doesn't do anything different. Like it 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 it's a regular phone that folds into a useless uh shell that you can fit in your pocket or purse or whatever a little more easily, but it does it has no practical function. Whereas this this is already a phone, right? <clears throat> right? Like this is that's a phone. This is what phones look like today. And then it opens up to reveal, uh, you know, a double phone. Like, it's twice as big. Like, and that has purpose. I don't understand the flip. Why would you get a flip? Stupid. Um, anywho. Oh, I could talk about that for hours. And I think I have here. <laughs> um, are you going to review the Steam Deck? I don't know. I don't know. Because I'm not a, here's the thing. Um, I, I think the Steam Deck is really cool. Um, I 100% see the, uh, the the incentive behind it. But I don't really see myself getting a Steam Deck right now because I'm not a very heavy um, PC gamer. I'm not. I'm a very casual gamer. I like Nintendo Switch games and a couple of PS4 games, stuff like that. I don't do a lot of, like, Steam. I do some Steam gaming. For sure, but not enough for me to uh, get a Steam Deck. Even though it's very cool. It's a, ma it's a PC, you know, it's a portable PC. And the controls look great. There's so many options. It has a touch screen, but it also has the dual touch pads and dual joysticks and a million buttons on the back that you can customize. 
there's a lot to love about that thing. And it can run anything a PC can run. That's that's huge. But uh, would I personally get much use out of it? No, because I don't think I'm the right demo. People who would love that are people who frequently play Steam games um, and want to play like Hades on the go, for example. Um, you know, for, for, for lack of a better uh, example. Oh, Bunny wrote, have you played Little Nightmares? Yeah, we played Little Nightmares. We played the uh, the DLC or the expansion. And then, uh, you know, half a year ago, whenever it came out, we did buy Little Nightmares 2. And here's what really grinds my gears. I really enjoyed Little Nightmares 2. I was intrigued. Um, I was having a good, good little time with Little Nightmares 2. And then I encountered a game-breaking bug. And I could not get past it. Um, and I couldn't get past it. And it was like, I, I, I don't know where it was in the, maybe it was like halfway through the story to the, the, you know, the main, main game mode. Um, but I encountered a fucking, it was some boss, bo uh, boss fight with like these little goblins that like came out and fucked with you or something. And I beat them. I would beat like multiple times. I would beat the boss battle or I'd win the boss battle and the game wouldn't progress. Like a, a plank of wood that's supposed to come out of the wall wouldn't come out. And I was like, maybe I'm not doing it right. I watched YouTube uh, or I watched a lot of like long plays and let's plays on YouTube. And whatever was happening to these guys was not happening to me. I encountered the game breaking bug. Um, I think it was the PS4 version, if you're curious, but um, I never got past that. So that, uh, yeah, super frustrating. Super duper frustrating. But, you know, what are you going to do, LOL? <laughs> Um, have you seen Malignant now? I did, we did see Malignant, actually. We watched it, like, last week, I think. I won't spoil it. Um, I will say, I could do it. Uh, here's the, I, I have a huge aversion to jump scares. Not like, I, I like thrillers. I don't like jump scares. Anything with a jump scare, I just, it, I find them very unpleasant, the jump scares. And Malignant's got, you know, it's fair share but uh you can see you, you know when they come you like you can see them coming uh for the most part yeah and um is it worth it i think it's worth a watch it's worth a watch it's pretty bonkers um you know people are talking about it and uh yeah if you want to be a part of the conversation i think it's worth it i'm glad i saw it What's the scariest movie I've watched? Oh, the Ring was pretty fucking terrifying. Yeah, The Ring's up there. Aaron made me watch that years ago. That was not a fun watch. Just the amount of dread. Is that the scariest movie I've seen? It's up there. Hmm. Last movie that made you cry for the wrong reasons? Fuck. That's a great question. I don't know. But we did just finish a Hulu show. I think it was Hulu. Uh, called Nine Perfect Strangers. It's just one season. I think it's a limited series. Limited run. So it's just one and done. One season and then you're done. Um, it just ended on like Tuesday. Oh shit. Tonight's Ted Lasso night. Fuck yeah. Uh, but it just ended. And um, I, I highly recommend that. It's a lot of fun. So if you just watched, um, or if you watched uh, The White Lotus, as we also did, I also recommend that. Um, we watched White Lotus. We loved it. I was on HBO. And then right after that, this weird little show called Nine Perfect Strangers came out. And we were like, I, I was kind of like, oh, this kind of looks like White Lotus Light. You know, it's it seems like the perfect palate cleanser. 
um, or spiritual successor to White Lotus. And uh, it's really good. I really... They're both really good shows for very different reasons. I feel like White Lotus is more comedic. But Nine Perfect Strangers is also worth your time. Would you actually buy the N64 membership expansion with the $50 controller? I don't know, man. I don't know. It's like, honestly, it is very hard to justify buying all that. When we live in a world with, you know, increasingly more functional emulators, it's tough to justify laying down that kind of, especially if it's monthly, especially if you need to buy a like another online monthly bundle like a subscription bundle just to play a handful of n64 games you've already played in your youth you know my my youth uh i don't know man nintendo is clearly going for the nostalgia bait i'm sure it'll work i don't know if i'm into it though i don't know if i'll do it at that point yeah i was just gonna queen you you beat me to it at that point just buy an n64 just buy an N64 or emulate it. What? Who said that? What's with the glitch motif? What are you talking about? Um, Oh, that's cool. What up, Pre uh, Pre Pretov? Pretoval? Good to see ya. Thanks for joining our stream. And very cool about uh, my music. Did someone say emulate? Nice, nice emote. Um, sorry, I'm trying to catch up with all the uh, the the chat here. It's a lot. It's a lot. You guys are asking really good questions. What are you offering? Are you offering? Is it free? What's that from? What is that from? Oh. Drift. Driftless Pony Club. Huh. Oh, it's the My Music themes. I'm an asshole. <laughs> uh. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Is that the one that's like, what are you offering? Are you offering? Is it free? Yeah, right? Oh, I nailed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. That brings me back. Sorry, I just Googled it. I found the song. Wow, 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 wow. Damn, dude. I haven't heard that in uh, close to 10 years. Jesus. Doing the don't get TMCA challenge. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, Have you ever watched Outlander? Yeah, we watched a good chunk of Outlander. We watched like all of season one of Outlander and then some of season two. And I think we quit. I think season two started to slow down for us. Um, but uh, it was interesting. Interesting show. Maybe we'll give it a shot later. Again, I mean, another shot. I just got here. Did the eye suck? No, it was fun. Um, there's, there's, there are a lot of good moments in this eye. Um, like I said, I think I can crank out a, a, obviously a short, maybe a short video too, like a full, like a full length video, not a YouTube short, but maybe like a two or three minute sucker. Um, but I definitely want to do another. I think after this, I think I'm gonna go to go back to break me in four words because that was um, extremely successful.
are you going to watch the Amazon Lord of the Rings show? Hell yeah, I'll give that a shot. I'm not like the biggest Tolkien fan, but I am a big fan. I, I genuinely loved the uh, Lord of the Rings trilogy. And my, you know, my, my knowledge of that world is severely lacking. But I just hold those Peter Jackson movies um, uh, to such a high standard that um, I will bear, I, I can't not watch the Amazon show. Also, I think the, sh the budget is re Let's look at the budget of the budget of Amazon Lord of the Rings. It's something absurd. Okay, this is report. This is from a uh, report from April. Amazon's The Lord. This is, I don't know if I believe this. It's from The Hollywood Reporter. I guess they're pretty reputable. Amazon's The Lord of the Rings to cost $465 million for one season. I don't... Quote, this will be the largest television series ever made. I've never heard of anything like that. Half a billion for one season of television. That's insane. That's fucking insane. I don't know. I mean, like, that fact alone makes me curious. I have to, like, it's such a, what a spectacle. What a fucking spectacle. When ya SMP. Oh, Kai. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Someday we'll talk. We'll we'll talk. Um Do you like any of the aliens movies? Too spooky. Mm mm. Take away all those scary parts and I'm down, but I I don't know, man. I, I really want to see Aliens. I really want to see that one. I know it's been out for 40 years almost, but like, I I really want to see Aliens. Never have. I've heard it's very, it's a good action movie. But I think in order to see Aliens, I have to see Alien. And that's more of the horror movie. And me and horror, you know, we got a weird, spooky relationship. Thoughts on the Matrix sequels? Oh, it's funny. Um, I recently flew back um, to see my folks uh, a few weekends ago, and I downloaded The Matrix Reloaded on HBO Max on my phone. Not to watch the whole movie, but just in case I got bored on the plane and I wanted to watch some of the fight scenes from The Matrix Reloaded, because they're pretty fucking wild. Um, and uh, I never did. Totally, you know, ran out. I didn't run. I had too many other things to watch. Um, but I will say the fight scenes in the second one are great. Everything else kind of sucks about the two sequels. Especially the third. The third one's real bad. Or the the um, Resurrections. What's it called? Revolutions? I literally can't remember. The subtitles are terrible. But the third Matrix movie... Not good, not not very good. Um, but the second one, which also isn't very good, has some of the best uh, action scenes, I think, in his in cinema history. And I saw the trailer for the fourth. I think I was actually back home. That's a funny thing. Too. I I was home with my folks when um, it was trending all over Twitter. The trailer for the fourth one just came out. Uh, and I watch it, and I had the goofiest fucking smile on my face the entire time I watched that trailer. Um, it looked really cool, and it gave away nothing. That was a cool thing, too. Like, it was just enough, just enough of a tease to make me like, yeah, I would I would see this in a theater, for sure. I would watch that. Um, 
and I, I don't think it gave away too like I, I don't really know what it's about how is neo back how is trinity how is anyone back you know uh and who knows i'm intrigued <clears throat> Have you played God of War and are you hyped about Ragnarok? Yeah. <clears throat> My God. Sorry. Yeah. I played all three of the, the first trilogy from the PS2 to the PS3. God of War. One, two, three. And then I played God of War from the PS4. I enjoyed it a lot. It wasn't my favorite, though. Everyone, it, I remember it got this just unanimous praise. Um... And I felt a bit underwhelmed when the credits rolled, when I beat that game. Um, I, I, I just, I don't know. I feel like the enemy variants were not varied. You fought the same big troll guy, like, you know, five different times. You know what I'm talking about? Like the big troll with a with a club, that like pillar column. You just fought like different versions of, of him throughout. Great story, amazing graphics, amazing acting. Uh, but I kind of got tired of killing the same enemy type like 30 times. Um, my favorite God of War is probably God of War 2 for the PS2. That was a crazy God of War. Because the biggest criticism of God of War 1 for the PS2 was the lack of boss fights. So they're like, fuck you, here's 30 boss fights. And they were all different, they were all insane. Um, it had a great story, it was ep it truly was, an ep it felt epic. It was like a real epic Greek story. Like you had to go see the 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 Fate Sisters, the Sisters of Fate, to change your fate. And oh my God, you have a fight with the first two. It's epic, and you think like, okay, I'm done, I did it. And then you see the third Sister of Fate, and it's just like this big fucking menacing blob. I remember you like walk down a hallway and you see her for the first time, and you just and she just goes. <laughs> Oh my god, it was fucking awesome. It was... Talk about mood setting. So, 2 always holds a special place in my heart. I will play God of War Ragnarok. I will 100% get that sucker. You know, I want to see Thor. I want to see Odin. They keep teasing Odin. Or they kept teasing Odin. Odin, 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 Odin. We never saw Odin. Um, so yeah, I will... Uh, I'll pick up Ragnarok for sure, and I'll, I'll bet I'll enjoy it a lot. But we need more enemy types, man. It was, it was, it, yeah. Who shot Mr. Burns? I think we all did. I think we all share some blame. Also Maggie. Oh, that's another thing. I downloaded a shit ton of old school um, Simpsons episodes. Oh, I yeah. That's the other. Th that's another reason why I love this phone. I'll I'll show you. Hopefully, I. Just... Everyone gives a shit about my phone, honey. You don't know shit. Shut the fuck up. You don't know what you're talking about. Um, this is the best. All right, check this out. Whoop. Okay, so I got all these. I got some old school Simpsons episodes here. On Disney Plus, you can download up. You can download content. It's one of the most of these streaming sites you can. And I know you guys are like, "Ew, that crease!" Though, yeah, you can see the crease because there's a big fat ring light shining on. I'm telling you, man, you don't notice the crease; it goes away. All right. Here's what. Here's one of the reasons why I love this fucking phone. Right. If you watch something, if you're watching older television or an old video, um, the ratio is four three. Everything you watch, the stream you're watching right now, the ratio is 16 by 9. It's widescreen, right? Every Most most every YouTube video you watch nowadays is this ratio, 16 9. TV wasn't widescreen because there were no widescreen TVs in the 80s and 90s. Um, you know, it, it was the ratio of 4 by 3. It was this ratio, actually. Uh, and to prove it to you, Check this shit out. Let's play a regular episode of Simpsons. And oh my god, it takes up the whole screen. It takes up let's let's mute so I don't get uh YMCA'd here. Uh 
and that nothing is lost. There's no cropping. This is the, because Disney actually finally went back and fixed. Remember, there was a whole thing where like Disney cropped The Simpsons and like it actually cut out jokes. They finally went back and you have the option if you want to restore it. This is restored. It takes up the full screen. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, they're, oh, it looks like they're all wearing like face masks because of the green screen. That's funny. But it takes up the whole, like you can't do this on your phone. You can't take out your phone. If you try watching old Simpsons, it's going to have these big black bars on the sides, right? Um, but like this thing is made for watching like old school content because it's, it's huge. It's like, oh my God, oh, did I die and go to Simpsons heaven? And by the way, uh, pre widescreen Simpsons is the good Simpsons, you know, I did, you could say the same thing about SpongeBob. There you go. For a, a more modern reference, uh, People are like, ooh, when there are those black bars on the sides, you know it's a good SpongeBob episode. Well, same thing with The Simpsons. Uh, so, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You could even say the same about Family Guy. You sure could. In fact, I think I had the first three seasons of Family Guy on DVD, and I treasured them. I rewatched them so much. Ah. Oh. Family Guy used to be phenomenal. Just fa na ma na. Have you gone to see any movies in theaters yet? No. No, the last movie we saw in theaters was that Pixar movie. You're not watching Ted Lasso without me, are you? Okay. Oh, okay. I'm gonna join you real soon. Onward, thank you, onward. That's the last movie we saw in theaters. That was like, what, March? No, fe February or March of 2020. That's the last movie we saw in theaters. Then the thing happened. The thing is still happening. Um, But I think, here's, I got a couple of movies on my uh, on my list that I would probably see in a theater. Spider Man, No Way Home. I'm absolutely seeing that in a theater, purely for the nostalgia of seeing Doc Ock, Willem Dafoe, Tobey Maguire. You know, assuming all that happens. I mean, at least we'll get Doc Ock, as evidenced by the trailer. But. Um, I will, uh, yeah, I will, um, I will definitely see that one. What else will I see? What else is coming out? I'm really bummed. I was going to see Jackass 4 in October. I was, I was down. Me and Sean were both down to see Jackass 4 in the theater. And then it got pushed to February. So, you know, boo-hoo. What else is coming out? There's some big ones coming out. Is, Matri the Matrix. That's coming out in December. I'll fucking see The Matrix 4. Yup. I think that's it. Oh, lol. The Dear Evan Hansen movie is out tomorrow. Oh, I've... Not a chance in hell I'll willingly see that movie. I've heard so many things. I heard... Uh, the poor guy, too. You know, great voice. I just heard that the casting was... Miscast. Um, and I just heard he's just unlikable, too. Given the events of the story. Um, Dune. Oh, Dune. Yeah. Here's why I don't really want to see Dune. I hear it's just, it's part one of part two. It's part one of a two-parter, right? I've heard that it just ends very suddenly because it's not a full story. You know, it's, it's part of a greater story, but I don't know, man. I don't know. What would you do if you retired from YouTube? I don't know. <laughs> there you go. It should have had James. James Corden could have saved Dear Evan Hansen. Fuck. That's a really good point. You know, if James Corden puts butts in seats, if they, if, if he was, if he were in Dear Evan Hansen, I would get all my friends to see it for sure. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to go uh, watch some James Corden movies. Love that man.
um, Cats Forever. And uh, you guys, uh, <laughs> James Corden is Evan Hansen. Let's let's fucking petition that. All right, you guys. I'm Audi three thousand. Um, thank you so very much, you guys, um, for being epic. New videos next week. I may have a new video out tomorrow. I certainly have a new short tomorrow too. I uploaded a dumb Mario shit post tonight, but I got a better video coming out tomorrow. It's called the top ten. Um, hottest cartoon dads. It's short. It's a, literally a YouTube short. It's coming out tomorrow. Also, might make your grammar or might upload your grammar sucks tomorrow. Um, but uh, yeah, stay tuned. In the next week, next week's a big one. We got um, Spook Me Up, October, uh, 2021. We got uh, at least one other yai next week, if not two more. Um, so uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, that's funny. Bob, Bob Belcher is the first. I, I shit you not. He's number ten on my list. That's all I'm gonna say. Alrighty, take care. Bye, guys. Oh, let's figure out. Let's see. Should we raid someone? Is there someone that I know that we can raid? Oh fuck yeah, my boy Hawkeye. Let's go. He's playing Mario Maker too. I think I'm pretty good at Mario Maker. I don't hold a candle to this guy. Go check out Hawkeye. He's killing it. He's a Mario Maker god. He can run circles around me, and I play the super expert levels. But this guy's on a different fucking level. Check him out. He's highly entertaining. He's very good at what he does. Give him some love. Tell him I sent you. Uh, bye.